everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Erwin Ramiro, Nonconformist Watch Lover. In today's video, I want to talk about Casio AQF 100W watch. that the Casio is a giant company is many different electronic devices uh, if we are talking about the especially affordable watch category we cannot skip the Casio brand it's a very well known with their value of money and durability watches we will be for sure consider the Casio watch so Casio is very interesting popularity that even though people who has the luxury watch in their collections they do still have and they respect the Casio personally I have a very deep relationship with Casio because my first watch was a legendary Casio 91 uh, F91W. Uh, it's a most popular Casio watch as well all around the world and many people are really know it, use it or it's their first watch too. And my second watch was Casio 2 and I had a databank Casio. Especially uh, Casio is currently become a more more popular and back in the days we were we weren't aware that much because we were kids we were so active childhood when we go to watch shop with our parents the watch shop owners or the watch representative there they usually suggesting for kids the Casio because of their durability and to be honest I have so many experience I fall down because I that's why I said like we had very, not like right now we had really super active childhood even though we don't do nothing we were just a jumping <laughs> jumping in the classroom and always wrestling and we were falling down and the Casio is really the most durable about that kind of situation. So why I picked that watch? Winter is arrived, especially the Canada has a harsh wind. So we all like to go winter activities as well. There is no category like a winter watch maybe or when we talk about winter watch, I'm talking about winter activities like a skiing, snowboarding. Even though if you, if you don't do anything in winter, still when you go walk around or with hanging out with your friends, even those small accidents are occur. So usually I prefer in winter time to wear the watch is usually very uh, cheap price because if you fall down it break it's expensive watch you feel be really worried but if it's like a, a good price watch you won't be worried that much so i can't say specifically winter categories but i am looking some certain details specifications what i'm wearing at the winter watch so that's a good option because it has some specifications is very well matching in the winter situation so it's like a temperature worldwide timer the most important at winter watch is durability of course because there's a if there's a fragile or like a dress watch it will be really even though a little bit small accident will be damaged the watch and the second is i am looking something nice looking and the light and luminous as well that watch is uh, boat has it so if it's a boat it will be nicer because winter is as we know that it's getting darker very early even though not darker still we need the light option as well and the temperature is very important because as we all know that in winter time temperature differences is really not like a summer it's it's going very down and we would like to know that to how is the temperature right so even though like uh, you have phone internet and you can check in there but still there is a there is a some time when you are out you are considering about your battery at the phones so in this case too nice to have the watch that features as a showing the temperature 
light and lumino option it's another consideration about what i picked that watch and the last to say the water resistant whenever you are doing any winter activity you are dealing a lot of with water at least 5200 matter resistance is very important too i like digital watch but i prefer more likely the analog digital because of makes me feel like uh, more the traditional watches so the reasons this four five reason is i decide that watch and actually it got my attention right away and i think that it's nice to share with the people uh, from my perspective let's go back to details that's how it looked like on my seven inch wrist uh, case diameter is 43 millimeter and lock to lock is 44.2 millimeter case thickness is 14.1 millimeter also lock width is 20 millimeter how lightweight this watch is 92.45 grams but the feeling is much more than this honestly the material how they use is the case stainless steel and there's a lots of resin touch here so there's a five bottom by the way and the back is stainless steel my understanding is it's too lightweight watch the bracelet strap is i think aluminium exactly not stainless steel push button deployment clasp i i can't say where the high quality high build can be scratched easily looks like but still very lightweight and nice bracelet on it so this is a out gear so there is a lot of function the most beautiful thing about the dial is yes very busy analog hand markers plus everything is very well detailed this watch has tight and moon graph as you can see here when you push the first you see this is a tight graph but battery life is around two years and the japanese movement Accuracy is what I uh, what I search in uh, online. It says minus plus 30 seconds per month. So pretty well. I didn't get like a long time ago this watch. So I'm still discovering too. If you want, I might be make a very detailed video as well. Just like the functions. The mode, tight graph, stop timer, timer, countdown timer, alarm. Uh, world timer and world timer has actually uh, 30 time zones and 50 cities that's a very uh, good function and day date okay so what's the display when we look at this is the moon face tight graph uh, time time details analog as well temperature on and off i usually use off because i don't want to make noise and there's a sensor button as well especially winter time we uh, the temperature is very important function and also has a luminance and the light as well that's really a very good look also has a light as well that's a beautiful electroluminescence this functions is the uh, i can say the most important with temperature of course the the 100 matter water resistant is important too when the out gear we are looking to durability yes water resistant and um, lightweight as well too uh, light and lumen is the most important details about this watch as well also i want to show you the back cover of the watch that's very comfortable to be honest basically 100 matter water resistant and thermometer plus the lumi and the light form from my observation is the most key features at this outgear watch 
As you see in details, that's a very good watch, especially in winter conditions. Everybody is looking some alternative in their collection. Uh, but one thing is this watch is not available all the gray market. So it's not that easy because this watch is discontinued. It doesn't mean that you cannot find that watch. You can find, but sometimes it's used one. However, there's a in eBay, there is a mean condition is somehow is a still brand new watch. It's eligible because of this continue and it's very iconic watch. They consider right now this watch is a retro watch. So just be considered and don't pay over $100. Uh, however, when you catch really at least mean condition or brand new, I strongly suggest especially who is looking this kind of option in their collection thank you for watching thank you for precious time see you next video bye bye